hi water signs and welcome to my channel this is the J medium so this is for scorpio cancer and pisces sun um, we're going to be talking about how does your love interest feel about you okay so this is for sun and scorpio pisces and cancer right please remember that this is a general reading so only take what resonates leave what does not how does Scorpio, Cancer, and Pisces love interests feel about them? How is Water Sign love interests feeling about them? How is Water Sign's love interests feeling about them? All right, so you have the Eight of Pentacles, you have the Queen of Pentacles, and you have the Four of Cups. Clarify the Eight of Pentacles. You have the Knight of Wands. Clarify the Eight of Pentacles. Oops, you have the Nine of Wands. Ooh, someone here is really struggling, clarifying the Queen of Pentacles, Five of Swords. Clarifying the Queen of Pentacles, Ace of Swords. Clarifying the Four of Cups, Eight of Wands. Clarify the Eight, the Four of Cups, Seven of Cups. All right, so starting with the Eight of Pentacles. Um, someone here feels, okay, so they feel rejected by you. That's what I'm very clearly hearing. With the Eight of Pentacles, they feel like this person has really been working hard towards getting an outcome with you. And I, I'm hearing a new beginning. They've been working very hard towards getting a chance with you. Um, I feel like this is going to resonate for those of you who have been in separation with your person of interest. Because like this Eight of Pentacles here, this person feels like they were working so hard. And each time that they get close to having you know a reunion or having a new beginning whatever you want to call it every time they get a get a get a get closer to being with you something happens to block them or to block you but what they don't realize is their hard work and you may not have recognized their hard work because that's part of the reasons as to why they're feeling quite defeated is because they feel like nothing has really changed in this connection they were investing so much of their time and their effort to get somewhere with you and nothing changed um and so with the eight of pentacles here what they don't realize is that their hard work did not go unnoticed you know, and the fact that their hard work was recognized, they were, in a sense, as they were working and, and, and putting in that time and that effort, they were manifesting, which is why with the Eight of Pentacles, due to their hard work, they will be rewarded. They will get, uh, you know, their wish. They will get what they want. But right now, you know, they're not very optimistic because they haven't seen any progress. In Clarity of the the king of pentacles you do have the knight of wands man this person wants to come in they're so passionate with this knight of wands here they're so so passionate um so much to the point where it's like they want to claim you because they feel like they deserve you they feel like they've been working so hard and like i said some of you may not even be aware of this you may not be aware of all the things that they were doing behind the scenes all the effort all the troubles that they went through behind the scenes just to be with you just because you didn't see it doesn't mean that it didn't happen all right and i i feel like that's that's what's bothering them is that you are not even aware of this passion that they have for you you know it's almost like if only if only they knew if only my water sign knew all the things that i've i've invested to make this work in clarity of the eight of pentacles you do have the nine of wands 
So this person is sort of like, they're all by themselves. They're very lonely, lonely right now. I feel like they sacrificed everything, whether that's disapprovals from family and friends who didn't want them to go towards you, whether it's, it's because of the consequences that they're facing due to leaving someone else for you. This person, like I'm telling you, it's like they went to war. It's like they went to war for you. They went on a battlefield for you. And they've lost a lot. They've sacrificed a lot. Something's happening in their life right now. And it's because they put their foot down and they left something behind to be with you. So it's like they're they're facing the consequences. All right. Um, for some of you who are or who who believe that they are in a in a twin flame, if you believe that you are in a twin flame and you are a water sign, I would refer you to my uh, most recent twin flame reading that I posted. It seems like this is connecting to the same kind of people where like your partner um, is having to face face the consequence okay of putting something behind to come towards you but yeah I'm here to confirm that this person has been through so much just because they've been trying to get with you next you have the queen of pentacles being clarified by the five of swords um Hmm. So here's the thing. They feel like you are, um, oh my goodness, Intuitive, intuitively what I'm seeing is that they feel like you are opposing them. It's like they're, they've been working for this connection, but they feel like you are working against this connection. You are doing the opposite of what they're doing or what they've been doing. They feel like you are now pretty much against this connection and you're trying to like get away from it um if that makes sense it's like you your goal is different from their goal their goal this whole time was to come to you was to make things work but your goal has been to get over them um interesting and I feel like it's because of the lack of communication between the two of you there could be a, a really big misunderstanding that is making you feel like the best thing to do is to walk away all right um yeah like opposing forces opposite sides it's really interesting yeah hmm in Clarity of the Queen of Pentacles, you do have the Ace of Swords. So with the Ace of Swords, oh my gosh, like you guys are really doing the opposite. Like the Ace of Swords, you are so determined to get away from this person. You are so determined to pretty much, like I feel like um, you're, you may be protecting yourself uh, because you're very defensive towards this person, but like, there's a big, big miss, there's a blockage in communication. There's a big misunderstanding here. Oh, wow. Hmm. Huh. It's like the both of you are passionate, but the both of you are passionate about two different things. They're passionate about coming to you and, and, and being with you, being in a relationship with you. That's what they're passionate, passionate about. That's what they've been working towards. But with the Ace of Swords, they, it's like they feel like you're passionate about moving on from them. Okay, water signs, this could be your soulmate. Like I said, some of you probably even believe that this is your twin flame. And it's really because this person, they like, it's almost like um, they can pick up on what you're doing even without talking to them, even without telling them. They can feel you. Like when you're pushing away and you're focused on something else, they can feel the, de the detachment. This person is very much in tune with you. It's kind of 
ugh, it's kind of like, I don't want to say it's scary. It's amazing, but it's like, wow, it's so powerful. Next, you have the Four of Cups being clarified by the Eight of Wands. So with the Four of Cups, they feel rejected by you. Oh, yeah, with the Four of Cups, they feel rejected. They feel like um, your attention is elsewhere. Yeah. They feel like you failed to recognize their passion for you in the past, and you're still failing to recognize their passion for you. In Clarity of the Four of Cups, you have the Eight of Wands. They feel like you're moving on. They feel like you've released this. And something else is your um something else has your focus. Your focus. Like you, yeah, you've let this go. You're choosing to not deal with it. And you know what? A lot of you guys may have valid reasons, but this is how they feel. In Clarity of the Four of Cups, you have the Seven of Cups. Oh yeah, they feel like um you you have options. Okay, um, some of you may have romantic options like other other suitors, or it could just be that you're most you're more focused on something else. Something else is satisfying you to the point where you're not you're not really caring about the connection with them. Yeah, there's like they feel you detaching pretty much, but. Water sign, Scorpio, Pisces, Cancer. This is how your love interest feels for you. Just remember that it is general. So take what resonates, leave what does not. Um, if you are interested in a private reading, please visit my website. I offer a variety of private readings of all prices. So if you're interested, the link is in the description box. Also, please like, comment, and subscribe to support my channel. Thank you guys so much for your support. Please be safe out there, all right, and have a great day.